Hello everyone, today we'll be exploring how to create an endless pager in Jetpack Compose. With the endless pager, users can swag list of items. When they reach the end, the page automatically cycles back to the beginning, providing a seamless flow. Let's dive in. First, let's take a look at a normal pager. As you can see, uh, it ends at C. And when we scroll back, it goes back to A. However, we can do this by making it endless. Let's examine the code. We have a composable board with an endless horizontal pager inside it. The endless horizontal pager has two parameters, a list and an item clicked lambda that returns the clicked item. We are displaying a toast with the clicked item. Inside the endless horizontal pager, we have a composable horizontal pager from the Android Ads Compose Foundation. Therefore, you will need to add the Android Ads Compose Foundation dependency to use horizontal pager. We also have a pager state uh, that we are passing into the pager, which we are using to get the current page position. We are passing item.size for page count. Inside the clickable, we are returning the clicked item, which we are finding using pager state dot settled page. Inside the pager, we are simply displaying the text according to the position of the page. To make uh, this normal pager an endless pager, we need to set the page count to the maximum possible value. We will create a variable with the value of in dot match value. If we check the value of in dot match value, we can see that it is the largest value an in can have. If you were to run this code now, it would run, but it would crash with an index out of bone exception if you try to scroll beyond position 2. We can fix this exception by finding the modulus of page by size of the items. When we run the code now, we can scroll beyond the last position. However, we still can't scroll in the other direction. To fix this, we simply need to start the pager in the middle of our page count. Therefore, we set the initial position to page count by 2. Now that everything is working as intended, the only thing left to fix is item clicked. We can do this by using the same approach we used earlier. Pager state dot settle page mode less items dot size. This also works with vertical pages. Simply change the horizontal pager to a vertical one. Thank you for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, please consider giving this video a like. I'll be creating more tutorials like this, so consider subscribing.